Welcome to CalCast, your creator national podcast. Network News, episode 211. Welcome, GNN fans, to another episode of God Network News, the podcast that tells you what God's doing around the world, not what CNN tells you, but what GNN tells you is going on in the world. If you're tired of listening to all of that crisis network news and you want to hear what God's doing, well, give us a listen. What other things, you know, just even dreams. There's one of them, um, uh, the man that I was telling you about, his name is Pedro. He is from Mm -hmm. Mozambique and he is working with the Yao and he has many fellowships now, more than 15,000 believers, uh, Yao believers. And also it's um, his movement has, has jumped over to, two or uh, three new people groups three other language groups because wow. the people maybe like yourself you mm-hmm. you're from one people group but your wife is mm-hmm. from another people group so when this happened when these people when these families came to the lord then the mm-hmm. wife said well what about my family's people group they don't have anything so they went and shared the gospel with them and the movement spread to that people group so now he mm. has four four people groups in his movement. Mm. And um, what I was going to say to you is uh, very early when I, we, I first met Pedro and I was hearing about his work, uh, mm. I said to him, Pedro, what is your dream? You know, what, mm. what would be an exciting thing, a tool, something that would help you reach the people you're trying to reach you know what is the dream you know that you have and he said oh he says i have a dream but i don't know if i want to tell you this <laughs> and i said no no tell me what is it he says i have a dream that i would have someday a movie a short movie um for the yao people that talks about how the yao people have come to know Jesus and what happened in their lives after they started following Jesus. And, mm. and it would be all Yao people and mm. in their language and, you know, their story and the gospel message would be in, in that movie. And so I said, well, okay, let's, let's pray. Let's pray. So now next year, so mm. it will be about two and a half years since we he first told me this. Next year, in mm. June, we will be mm. sending a film production team to, uh, to Pedro, to Mozambique, and they will train his uh, some of the believers there that he has that are younger people that want to learn media so that they can help the movement. And they are Mm. going to train them. And part of the training is making a film Mm. for the Yao people together with the Yao people. And Mm. they will make that film that he was dreaming about. Mm. And that will that will be next year in June. So my wife and I will probably visit visit them while the team is there. And uh so the idea is not mm. only to give them a film, but also to train their young people, especially uh, how can mm. we use our smartphone? How can we use a simple things that we have to make uh, films 
for the Yao people and for these other people groups in our movement to help them know Jesus, to help them learn discipleship, uh, all of these things. So, um, yeah, so I'm saying to you, uh, you should pray and ask the Lord, is there something, Lord, yeah. we need, something that you know that will help us, uh, you know, uh, go over the difficulties or the challenges that we have? And, and mm. then, uh, you know, and then we can mm. talk and you can share those with me in the future on our future calls mm. or whatever. Yeah. And uh, ah, there is a three things or four things I want to tell you. I, yeah, I want to, to say thank you so much for sharing this with me because uh, this is what I need in my ministry. The challenge missionaries, they, have, they, they don't have people who can help them to, to go forward because uh, yeah. many missionaries, they are living in the local areas. So they, no, no anyone can call you, no anyone can, can encourage you, can give you any materials. So this uh, is uh, this is very very nice to me to hear from you. If you have you're using these medias, so that is why when I hear I see the you attacked for the first time, I said yeah, I said wow, I need to know more about that because uh, the media, the media is uh, ah, it's a part. Many people, everyone, even even people, they don't know how to read any writing. They are hearing the 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 thing from the phones or radio yeah. or yeah. So people they yes. cannot read the writing, but they can hear something. So media yes. is powerful to, to to yeah to yeah to engage more more people or to hear the word of god because even the bible said the faith come for the hearing so yes that's right yeah so media is very very important and really i need it the this uh these these things i need it this audio bible cartoonist audio bible all of these i need it and uh Something I want to tell you is that one thing is uh, from 2017, when I, I arrived here in this Segejis areas, I, I got the vision to, to help my country. There is a many group, many people groups here in this country, not unreached. There are unreached people groups here. Yes, so yes. I, I started to engage you for the for the for the youth to see how can he, how can how can how can they go to another tribes or another people groups. So yeah. from that yeah from that time to this time, I have uh, more than twenty five different different people groups. And there is a missionary there. They are living in that areas. So wow, 20, yeah. 25 different places here in Tanzania. And this is uh, 25 different people groups. Wow. So many of them, they are Muslims. And uh, some of them, they are not a Muslim. They are traditional. Uh, yeah, they are traditional. So, yeah, like animus, animus, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that is my vision to see it, to see all people groups, uh, unreached people groups here in Tanzania to see, to see the movement in these people groups and to see their their worshiping God. So I Wonderful. have, a, yeah, I have a network in this country. Uh, different people groups, 25, and there is a missionary there. And uh, this is the one I do. And the second is uh, um, 
I'm going in the different places to teaching the churches uh, for the model one of the DMM training. So I'm doing the training for the different, different presses for model one uh, to sharing the gospel for the Muslim to starting the, the groups in different, different areas. So you're listening to God Network News Podcast with your host, Cal Curtis. Look up our website at godnetworknews.com. Yeah, so I have, I have, uh, I think this detail I will send to you we are now from from 20 from 20, from 2017 up to now we have more than 200 groups in different different areas in these countries uh these groups it's uh, yeah yeah these groups they are meeting and uh, they are meeting they are discovering bible study so that is why we need uh, more details uh, uh, or more materials about the leaders because at the end of this year, we have a plan to meet with all leaders in these different, different groups and uh, different, different people, different missionaries. So we will yeah. meet in December. So we will have, we have the time to sharing what, what God is doing there, what the challenge, what's, yeah, how can we helping each other? So I think uh, even, even Paulo, we will, we will need to come and to see and to help these leaders. And uh, because he, for me, I want to see my country have a movement. So that is my desire. Yeah, so, that's so, exciting. So are you yeah. saying, uh, Salome, that you that you um, are part of like a network of of men, of uh, missionaries that that are doing DMM and different in these like 25 different people groups? Is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is right. I have a network. OK. Yeah. OK, I see. I see. Wow, yeah. that's and, great. Yeah. And uh and uh, the last, uh, the last, I think the last week I was in the part of part of Tanzania. They calling Arusha. I went in Arusha and Tarime and Zanzibar also to to do the seminars, to do the seminars to engage for the Christians there how they can start in the groups. So and now. Now we we have we have a, we have 20, 20 youth they want to go different different uh, different unreached people groups here in Tanzania. So yeah. when you con yeah so when you continue to pray just pray for them we need to see how God can help them to to go and uh, to stay there because my desire is uh, by 2025, all people groups here in Tanzania, they can be rich or they can have the missionary lives in that area. So that is my dream. Yeah, that would be yeah. great. That's a great yeah. dream. That's yeah. a great vision. Very, yeah. very and good. Yeah, and the last one, last one, I did something. So I say I like media because I see, uh, I, I did a research here in Tanzania. Many people, they, they don't documentation because they, <laughs> they don't need to read because many people, uh, they didn't read. So, I did research something. I did some research from the different different areas. So and I I saw people they like to hear and they like to watch. So where I I took I don't know how I can explain more. Yeah, I don't know how I can explain more. But I took some people in there. I paid. This these people he's uh, he's uh, doing video production. 
I paid some money for him and to come to record me. And I did record, I record something how to share in the gospel. And he came in oh, this that's area. Great. Yeah, yeah, but this guy, yeah, he 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 wanted a lot of money. So I did some videos, it's a few videos. The videos I did is how to sh is to show how can you enter in the new place and to to find a man of peace. And the second is uh, how to sharing you are how to sharing the gospel. And the third one is uh, how can you start in the DBS or how can you do the discovering Bible study the questions. So I did this in Swahili. So I will try to send one video to see, and uh, I will continue to pray. When God help, when God help us, I I I think one day your team will come in to help us to learn more. How can we do the video production and uh, to help others to understand? Because there is a uh, many people they don't know what God is doing. So if we have some videos or audios, people to watch, they can see, okay, God is doing something and people, they can pray. So, yeah, yeah, I did that. And then I will send this one video to you to see what I did. And uh, I need you to pray for me, to help me. And this all thing I told you, yeah, keep in prayer and you see how can you help me because me, I want to see the movement in this area and my country. Yeah, definitely. I mean, we're also, I'm just wondering how, how difficult is it for you to get to uh, Malawi? Uh, is yeah. Malawi too, too difficult for you to go to or is it? Can you take a bus there? Yeah, I think uh, it's a, uh, yeah, I can go Malawi because I want to learn every place is I can, for me, I think it's not far because I want to learn. I want to see the movement. It is my vision. It is my desire. So even, even it's by bus, I can come Malawi. I can come. Any places you want me to come, I can come to learning. If I like to come to Malawi to learn more about media, I like that. Yeah, because I was thinking if you're available next mm -hmm. June, uh, mm -hmm. next June is when our team will be there and they'll be doing about, I think all, all together, it's about six weeks of training. So you, mm -hmm. you go through three, three weeks of training and lecture but the lecture is not, it's, it's using equipment. It's all skill development. You know, it's, it's very interactive. And then mm -hmm. what you're doing is you're preparing to actually be on the set with, with, uh, during the making of that film for the Yao people. I was just thinking if you, or maybe you had a um, one or two or three of uh, people that God puts on your heart uh, that, mm -hmm that that already know a little bit about media but they want to learn more so that they can use it to help the movement you see mm -hmm. and and those are the kind of people we want to train and equip mm -hmm. and uh it, you know if you just pray about that it's a possibility mm -hmm. that we that you could come with one or two uh people that mm -hmm. god puts on your heart and you could join the training there yeah yeah i, I will so do there's that. there's no yeah. the the training we do it as our ministry there's no charge for the training so wow i mean uh, the only thing would be i think that you you might have to pay something for food i don't know exactly how much maybe nothing i don't know but uh, mm -hmm. i can give you more information later um wow. but if you're just maybe be thinking about that and thinking about who who do i know maybe a young person or that wants to know, learn more about media so that they can use it to help mm. your movement. That's someone who's committed, you know, to you. Uh, then yeah. we can, tr we can 
tr give them the training and give them the mm. equipment and things like that that they need. Yeah. If you enjoyed this episode, please consider donating to help us continue to bring exciting stories fresh from the field. Visit our website at godnetworknews.com and select the PayPal link on the right side of the page or consider becoming a Patreon partner to receive access to more valuable materials exclusive to our members.